Casey Neistat's just got to 10 million subscribers, 10 million. And he said it was nowhere near as difficult as getting to 1 million, which was nowhere near as difficult as getting to 100,000. But the hardest of all was getting to that first 10,000. I got to that threshold 10,000 a month or so ago. And if you recall, we ran a competition and the prize, loads of Spitfire goodies, and I'd come and deliver them in person, wherever you were in the world. So today, quite excited, I've got my passport, gonna find out where I'm going to start this quest to find our competition winner. But first, I never ever take this Spitfire Odyssey for granted. But there are some days in particular, I really feel like the cat that's got the cream, sticking it to the man, living the dream. Loaded. Summer camp. And that's where I switched the camera off. I felt that this was kind of our time, our Spitfire time. And whilst most Spitfires don't mind appearing on camera, some are a little less keen. And I felt that for that day, we were kind of exposing our soft and slightly drunken underbelly. So I didn't switch the camera on until we got back to London to catch up with what's going on at the HQ. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, they're there. Hello. It's they're looking great. They're a little bit better than the one star, I like. <laughs> How are you doing? Uh, Excellent, yeah. brilliant. Very good, this is all very exciting. Aircon. Before we crack on, can I just ask, what, what is this thing? This is going to be where the doors are going to be. Just point yeah. out what's Meeting room, Meeting room. Paul and Christian, Paul founders. The prison. The, the prison. prison. <laughs> the young person prison. Whoa. Composer, composer. Show Homme, her stud walls have gone up. Homme gets to pick which studio she uses. I think this is definitely the coolest floor. Oh, wow. Yeah. So I think this is Nicholas' room. Oh, cool. Right. <laughs> Have a look at this one first. Obviously, not very interesting at the moment. That's, that's one. You glad you kept your window? Oh, God, yeah. Mmm. Mm. I guess one is more kind of cosy. This feels a bit more cosy. This feels cosy, I think. And I guess you can look, kind of stand and look out. This, I don't know why, but this would feel like the okay. Cool. We're gonna meet Homai's grandmother. Oh, this is nice. Meet. Oh. She made it all the way. Wow. But it just has that modular sound, doesn't it? Yeah, because this is my first, this is my very first synthesizer. And also it's a, it's a much to start off with, I want something that is that I can play with a little bit melodically. Mm -hmm. Learn that and maybe expand from here to go then into modular synthesis. Great. The initial kind of learning ramp is, yeah, is yeah. it's like a little bump, but it only takes a few hours and you go, ah, oh, I get it, you know. Yeah. I think this is a good segue. Absolutely, definitely, definitely. Yeah. Great. It's all looking fantastic in here. Pretty moving out soon. <laughs> Yeah. But it's going to look great in the new place. Excellent. Well, I'll leave you to it. Okay. See you later. Have a good weekend. Spitfires. I'm sorry to see that Homai is possibly going into a Euro crack rabbit hole, courtesy of her grandmother. Anyway, time to get on and find that competition. But without a little diversion first. Make much sense. Home. <laughs> What's the beeping? 
We'll stop the beeping in a minute. Is it just, it's, to, it's, just to, to test just, the mic? Uh, rehearsing the sync pip that the camera's going to use to uh, align themselves yeah. later. That's Excellent. Fine. Making sure it's nice and loud. Oh my lord! Yes, I think that is a motion control rig. <laughs> Very exciting. After an, another minor diversion. Was this part of this new reissue thing? Yeah, I believe so. Harry got it in. Um, I don't know if it was used yet, but it looks very nice. So I'll text you another time. If Great. Not. Excellent. Oh, no. Oh, no. This <laughs> is the thing. Okay, don't leave it on the it's train. It's the whole purpose okay. of my thing. Right, well and truly on my way now. To be honest, the odds were always pretty way towards it being within commuting distance of either London or LA. More so London, I would say, if you look at my geographical stats. And the chances of it being a girl, well, pretty much uh, non-existent. Matthew, how are you doing? <laughs> Excellent. Have a seat there, mate. So do you live in central Cambridge? Just south, so ten minute drive. Oh, that's great. It's not too bad. How was the journey? Yes, fine. I was I was in uh, uh, what's it called, London. Uh, is that yeah. our table at the middle? So it was fine. Yeah, I was kind of nervous because it's the summer holidays. I was kind of nervous that the winter was going to be in Tahiti or something, <laughs> <laughs> or worse still, Syria. Yeah. Um, actually, <laughs> got some bits for you. So, thanks so much for your support. Oh, right. okay, a little louder. Mm. Yeah. Now this, mm. you've got to keep absolutely secret because we haven't announced it. I'll, 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 I'll um, pixelate it. So. Mm. But basically, we made our first. Mm. Was it a guess, or did you actually? Did you actually what, watch what, it? You said it twice. <laughs> <laughs> Symphonic strings, woodwinds, hands in the strings, and mats. <laughs> we checked your account, thought you could do with those ones. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Matthew, lovely guy. Uh, I've linked to his site below. He's going to be moving to the big smoke soon, so um, hopefully offer any help I can to his soon to be hugely successful career, I imagine. So see, at first, this whole Spitfire thing was about getting the best orchestral samples we could for Paul and I for free. Almost immediately became more about the people, getting to know the Air family, talking about people. It's mental, isn't it? And over the years, it's become less and less about our train set and more about the people. At first, meeting the musicians, becoming friends with them, and then great to be able to give our friends and musicians royalties over the years. And then we started meeting the composers and the community got bigger and bigger and making friends with amazing composers, some childhood heroes and some new up and coming talent. Great to meet Matthew today, my YouTube channel, that community. And then, well, just over the last year or so, Spitfire has shifted from being about ones and o's to being just a group of brilliant, like-minded individuals working together, a little family, and that's something that I'm more proud of than anything that we've achieved so far. So do I feel like the cat that's got the cream? Certainly, especially when working with people as lovely as this, people who agreed to share some of these fantastic photos. Thanks as always for your support. Thank you, Matthew, for your support. And um, see you again next time. The standstill is mental.